Hey guys, Kristen with IC Stars Quilting here. I just got a notification on my phone that my ginger quilter box is here and I am going out to the mailbox to go get it because I'm so excited. I love this box. not to trip over fabric and things that are in the way here because as you can tell hmm, this kind of a mess today in here <laughs> uh actually it usually is a mess but today it's definitely a mess so let me see if i can get this on my tripod so that i can stop making some of you motion sick and let's dig into this ginger quilted box i love it when i get this box in the mail not only is it pink, it's so cute, but there's always good treasures in here. So let's uh, get cozy here and let's dive into this box. So the Ginger Quilter box is a box that comes monthly. And first thing that you always pull out is this right here, which if you like, you can pause your video and see everything that is included. So this is the March 2024 bag and there's all kinds of fun spring things in here. Also in here we got a pattern for a mini quilt pillow which is adorable. It's very very bright and sunny today so hopefully this kind of shows up well and you can see all of that but it is a very precious spring meadow mini quilt pillow and it is a 16 by 16 pillow okay so not only did you get like what the pillow looks like you got step-by-step -step instructions with illustrations i love that on how to put together that pillow okay look at this do you know how far this box had to travel and then still end up perfectly in shape like everything is exactly where it needs to go natalie at the ginger quilter you are amazing because that's that's impressive to me okay because i've shipped things for many many years and <laughs> i'm always afraid of how they're gonna end up like once they get opened on the other side like absolutely nothing has moved everything is still cut and in like the perfect positioning so what we're making is that little adorable pillow and a lot of this fabric, I'm guessing you only need just a little bit for. So there's not a ton of extra in this project. She's given you just what you need to make that sweet little pillow. And a lot of these are, you know, two and a half inch strips. So you have several of them that are just the right size for those tiny little diagonals on the pattern, okay? They look like little half square triangles. I'm sure the pattern would tell me. <laughs> and then for the bigger pieces, you do have some bigger chunks of fabric in here as well as the background fabric. This is beautiful fabric. So in case you're wondering, the Spring Meadow pillow pattern is by Ellis and Higgs. Okay, so you can go on there and see if you can download that if you're interested in that. Um, what we have is I am so in love with these. I just dropped off mid-sentence, I know. But I love these. Okay, have you seen these? Because I was introduced to these, um, I don't know, was it a year ago? I think it was at Quilt Fest or something like that. Okay, it is a binding holder and yes, what I'm trying to show you is yes, it does glitter just like you think it would. So it is acrylic and it is a binding spool, okay? So what you do is you put the end of your binding through this little hole right here and then you wrap it like you would a spool. 
trying to find the name of the company. Stitch Supply Co. is the name of the company. And if you want to look them up, there you go is the information. Um, it holds enough two and a half inch wide binding to complete a king size quilt. Pretty impressive, okay? So it helps you take away that ginormous mess of a knot that ends up on the floor when you're trying to bind a quilt, okay? I'm just saying not all of us have that problem, but some of us do. All right. We got some mini Cadbury eggs that are always good to add to the snack drawer for when you are sewing late at night and you need a little boost in energy. We got this adorable little wall plaque that has Easter egg hunt and it says hop this way. Very cute, very, um, very springy. I love the little Easter eggs in the back of the truck. We got some little hand sewing needles here. Are these hand sewing? I'm wrong. They're not hand sewing needles. These are machine sewing needles, okay? But they are just your regular home use sewing machine needles and it's organ needles. Here is the muslin that is for the back of the pillow. And then she also included, very nice, she also included the batting for the quilting of the front of the pillow. Very, very nice, that's awesome. So you have absolutely everything in here to make this beautiful pattern. Let me pull it out again so you can see this beautiful quilted pillow pattern right here. So that is so cute. And you know who just last night decided that I think I'm kind of tired of the pillows on my couch that have been there for like, I don't know, a millennia now? Me. So this comes at a really good time. I'm so glad. I love getting this box in the mail. It is such a fun box and I know that there's a project in every single box. It captures my style, it captures my likes, but it also challenges my thinking just a little bit. Like, was I ready to make a pillow? I was not, but now I'm totally gonna make a pillow because this is fun. I love it. And it's it's right around the corner here for Easter. Um, well, actually Easter is like this week. So it's still spring. It's still a spring pillow. It doesn't have to be Easter, okay? It's still a spring pillow, but I am gonna go put up that cute little sign right in my entryway right now. If you're interested in subscribing into the Ginger Quilter subscription box series, make sure you check out their website. I have linked them in the description box down below as well as added a couple coupon codes in there that were given to me specifically by Natalie from the Ginger Quilter. That way you can get a little bit of savings in there. It's so nice when I can, when I feel like I can give you just a little bit of help in that way right and then you get really cool boxes coming your way so whether you're looking for a gift for yourself a birthday present for a friend Christmas gift um, Arbor Day gift I don't know <laughs> whatever you have coming up ginger quilter box is a really great way to go I hope that you have a wonderful rest of your day I'm gonna go I'm gonna go sell for a little bit I'm Kristen with icstarsquilting.com if you want more tips tricks and tutorials like the video you just watched make sure you hit that subscribe button pretty pretty please and hit that little bell afterwards I'll talk to you next week Bye.